Hi everybody, Eddie Cabello with Inside MusicCast. Rick is behind the camera. And uh, we're uh, really glad to, to welcome Dave Weckl to the Jazz Kitchen tonight. As, uh, as you guys know, he's a master musician. You know his work with, uh, with my goodness, with, with everyone. He's been with Chick Corea's Electric Band and Mike Stern. And we're just happy to have him here with Oz Noy and Jimmy Hassip. Welcome. Thanks. Yeah. yeah, happy to be here. Long, uh, long tour, ready to go home? Uh, well, not yet. We got some, you know, we got some shows to play yet. Yeah. yeah. So we're we're always have we always have a lot of fun playing, and exactly. it's always great to you know have people come out and check it out and, and share the music. So, yeah, we're glad to be back in India. It's been a few years. So yeah. You you played with so many people over the the decades of your career, and uh, now with Oz, his music. How can you describe playing with him well, as to who you you played in the past? Yeah. Well, I mean, that's the joy of playing with uh, with so many people is that different people mm -hmm. is that they're you know everybody brings brings themselves to the music and and uh, you know their artistry and their personal side to it too. So, mm -hmm. you know, playing with this band is a lot of fun because it bridges uh, a lot of a lot of genres and it, it kind of bridges a rock thing with a jazz thing and mm -hmm, mm -hmm. it's a kind of heavy groove thing but at the same time there's a lot of interaction and dialogue so you know Oz is a very deep musician he's got he's got a lot a lot going on with the harmon harmony and he, he really knows his stuff and uh, and of course with all of his pedals and effects he's uh, you know he's a one-man show pretty much you know it really a lot of a lot of different uh, textures and sounds yeah. happening Son sonically what yeah, he creates with his guitar, yeah. So right? it makes it a lot of fun to 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 create those textures too. So with a trio, we can get away with you know making it feel like there's a lot of diversity going on because it's not just you know one instrument, one instrument, one instrument. He's got so many textures. Mm -hmm. So and I've got enough things to hit to make a lot of sense. Yeah. <laughs> well, the three of you guys on stage. You know, you're a technical player. Jimmy's a technical player. Oz is technical. He doesn't think he's technical. I think he's very technical. Well, let me just qualify that because I. I kind of hate when people say, "Oh, you're just a technical yeah, player," because yeah. you know, technique is a means to an end, sure. and we we all we all approach playing music to play what we feel, yeah. and the idea is to get a feel across. So, if we're playing something that is that we have in our mind that we want to say, mm -hmm. um, you know, from a from a standpoint of it being complex or maybe a few notes uh, more than a lot of people would would consider proper. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it takes technique to do that. Yeah. So, um, you know, we've we've all spent a lot of time with our instruments, um, you know, trying to, um, I won't say master them because you can never master anything really. I think it's uh, it's always a lifelong, you know, ch challenge, and you're always chasing it. But, but was it, you know, I know for me, I've spent a lot, a lot, a lot of time uh, developing, you know, the way to play mm -hmm. and. Um, you know, anybody that sees the show will realize that, that it's kind of like, okay, you're just grooving, you're not doing anything, and then all of a sudden we do stuff. So, yeah, exactly. so it's not it's not just balls of the wall technique all the time, and and like I said, it's always a means to an end. So, mm -hmm. so we 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 I know for me, I try to put the music first. I try to play to support the music and have it be something that um, you know the average listener can can relate to, but also. When we start having the dialogue, there are there are times when, you know, if you don't have the technical ability, you can't offer those yeah. kinds of ideas. So yeah. I was telling Jimmy that uh, Oz seems to give you a lot of space, improvisation, that type of thing. In the yeah, there's. I mean, well, that's a, there's that's the bonus of a trio. I mean, it's the the dialogue is fantastic, and then and then the space to uh, to to express and to play and to solo. Yeah, it's nice yeah. too. Well, thanks for being with here yeah. with us tonight, and uh, good to have you back at the Jazz yeah. Kitchen. Thanks, thanks for having yeah. us. Yeah, it's really good to be back. I'm sure. glad that you had a, a great, great tour so far. Yeah. Thanks a lot. All right, okay. thank you. All right, thank you.